Hello everybody, how are you all doing? I hope everyone is safe, healthy and positive at their home. This side Seema from East Scholastics and today's topic for science is taken from class 7th. So friends, our today's topic is photosynthesis. We are going to understand what is this photosynthesis and how does this process take place. So, before we understand and we go to the topic, we have an image on our screen. We, see our, we are seeing that a plant is preparing the food. For us, our parents or our mother prepare the food. We know it. But have, have you ever given a thought that how does plant make their own food? What is the process? And how does it work? So friends, today we will be understanding about this process. Photosynthesis. Now let's try to understand what is photosynthesis and how can we define it. So, the synthesis of food which occurs in the presence of sunlight is called photosynthesis. And during this process, the oxygen is released. So, the process by which the plant prepare their food is photosynthesis. And in this term photosynthesis, we can see two words that is photo and synthesis. Photo means light and synthesis putting together. So putting together all the things in the presence of light is the process by which the plant prepare their food. Now let's understand what are the various things or various components that are necessary for the process of photosynthesis to occur. So the major three things that are important for a plant or for a photosynthesis to occur is sunlight, carbon dioxide and water. So let's try to understand how does plant get all these things and from where these things are being attained in a plant. Sunlight, it is, it is given by the source of sun which is a available from sun. Coming up to carbon dioxide, plant takes carbon dioxide from the air which is present in the air. The plant takes carbon dioxide from there and water. Water is being attained or is being get by the plant from the root through, through the soil. Whatever the water is present in the soil, the plant gets it through their roots. So these are the major component for the process of photosynthesis to occur. We have seen what are the components. We have seen that what is the process of photosynthesis. But in a plant, where does this process of photosynthesis occur? Let's try to understand this thing. So in a plant, the process of photosynthesis takes place on the leaves of the plant. On the leaves, there are the tiny pores called stomata through which the carbon dioxide from the air is being taken by the plant. And the plant cell have the small tiny structure that are called as chloroplast. These chlo chloroplasts have chlorophyll, the green pigmentation because of which the leaves are green. This is because of chlorophyll. So this chlorophyll absorbs the water in the presence of sunlight. So friends, what we have seen? This photosynthesis takes place on the leaves where the carbon dioxide is being taken by the tiny structures on the leaves called stomata. And the plant cells have the chloroplast which have chlorophyll or the green pigmentation. These green pigmentation absorbs the water in the presence of sunlight. So this is the entire process of photosynthesis how it takes place and where does it takes place. So students, that's all for the day. Now let's do the quick recap of what all things we have learnt. We have learnt about photosynthesis. So photosynthesis is the process of 
putting together all the components in the presence of sunlight and this process is being done by plant. In short, the process by which the plant prepare their food in the presence of sunlight is termed as photosynthesis. And during this process, the oxygen is being released. So what are the various components that are essential for photosynthesis we have seen? We have seen water that it gets from the soil through their roots. Second one is our sunlight which the plant gets from sun. And third one is the carbon dioxide which the plant takes in from the air. And we have also studied about the place where the photosynthesis takes place in a plant. So, the photosynthesis takes place on the leaves of a plant which have the small structure called stomata. These stomata absorb carbon dioxide from air and the plant cells of the leaves have the tiny structure called chloroplast which have the green pigmentation called chlorophyll. These chlorophyll absorb water in the presence of sunlight. I hope it was an easy session and we have understood. So thank you all for watching my video. I hope you might have enjoyed this session and please do like, share and subscribe if you have enjoyed this session and Please do mention the topic related to science or maths on which you want me to prepare the video. We'll surely prepare video on that topic. And subscribe the channel so that you are notified for any upcoming video related to science and maths. So till we meet next, stay home, stay safe. Thank you.